So guys, for the first step, you wanna head over to search and type in settings, click on it. Once you're on this, we're gonna click on system. Then we're gonna click on display. Then you wanna make sure that your correct monitor has been selected. This one's mine right here. You might need to click on identify so that your monitor can pop up. Now, once you do that, you wanna scroll down to where it says display resolution. You wanna click on this and make sure that it's set to the recommended resolution. So guys, for the second step, you wanna head over to search again and type in Microsoft Store. Once you find this, you wanna right click on it and then click on app settings. Then next to Microsoft Store, you wanna click on the three dots and then click on advanced options. Then you want to scroll down and then click on reset and then click on reset again. So guys, for the next step, you wanna head over to search and type in Roblox Player and then click on open file location. Then you wanna right click on Roblox Player again and then click on open file location again. Now when it says Roblox Player Beta.exe, you want to right click on this and then click on Properties and then head over to the Compatibility tab and then you want to tick Run this program in Compatibility mode. You want to tick Disable Full Screen Optimizations and run this program as an administrator and then click on OK. You want to do the same thing for Roblox Player Launcher.exe. You want to right click on it and then click on Properties and then click on the Compatibility tab and then tick Run this program in Compatibility mode and then tick Disable Full Screen Optimizations and run this program as an administrator and then click on OK. Now you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed.